I'm here today with Point Loma sophomore forward, Haley Saray, junior guard, Kara Liggins, and head coach, Lisa Faulkner. Coach Faulkner, you guys are coming off a tough game out there against number seven, Hawaii Pacific. You guys do fall 98 to 83. Um, could you just take me through a little bit of this one? A top 10 team came into Golden Gym tonight. Yeah, no, they're a very good team, uh, very well coached. I think they've probably become the, um, the toughness team in our conference, kind of the, the team that everybody's chasing. And um, they made plays. I mean, you know, players stepped up and hit some threes that, are, that um, you know, were big time for them. And even so, we had a four-point game in the fourth quarter and still had our opportunities. And um, what I told the team is that to win a, a high-level game like that, to beat a, a top 10 team or a top 25 team in the country is you have to go make the toughness plays. You've got to make the plays down the stretch and get the, the defensive rebounds, keep people in front of you, go make layups. And we just are li we were a little shy of that today. And so um, I'm proud of the way we competed. I thought that was a much, much better performance than the Fresno game. Um, and you know anybody in the top six can beat anybody on any given night. And so us just playing really good basketball going into the conference tournament. And I think you know this game helped get rid of some of the negative feelings that we had from the Fresno game. And so hopefully that will carry over for the rest of the week. Tara, could you just talk to me a little about the competitiveness of this PacWest conference? Um, Hawaii Pacific doing really good to give themselves at least the regional rankings come out Wednesday. They're probably the number one team in the region. APU has been top 25 throughout the year. You guys have seen some. Could you just talk about this conference? It's just the challenges you guys face day in and day out. Yeah, absolutely. There are some good teams in this conference, even the ones who aren't top six. Um, everyone can compete in this conference. We've seen that in our past few games. Um, but I definitely think tonight was a good test for us as far as you know, bouncing back from that loss to Fresno, um, just coming out being tough. And that gave us a lot of confidence to know that we can play with any team in the conference. Haley, I want to talk to you a little bit. You guys have two more home games. You guys will play Thursday against Holy Names. You're going to play Saturday against Notre Dame, Dana Moore. I know we're not looking ahead, but sometimes Saturday when you have all those seniors, it can be a little bit emotional situation. Could you just tell me about the opportunity you've had to play with some of the seniors this year um, between Carol Schroeder, Angelis, who was here for one year, and Mo Peace. Just tell me about the opportunity you've had over your two years to play with those ladies. Yeah, they're just all amazing. They contribute so much to the team and so much just their character really uplifts us. So we're, we're losing a lot, but they're just great people on and off the court and we really respect them. So it's gonna be a tough night for everybody. And what do you guys gotta do to bounce right back? Um, I know you guys have a lot of games on the legs recently, <laughs> but you guys got another one on Thursday. What do you guys gotta do to just be physically ready for that one? Coach Lisa is emphasizing just playing our best basketball and competing. So we did that tonight. We just need to up it a little bit more and then hopefully go into the conference tournament with a two series win streak. So. Awesome. Thank you very much. Thank you, ladies. Yeah.